last time some things may have happened. Guy's stealing all the loot. Oh, sorry, dude. Yeah. I killed him with a fire extinguisher. Bit mean. But I think we might be killing him. Again, don't like doing that kind of thing. But we need the fuel. Ah, We're stone cold killers now. Oh. Who's this? No, it's still a stranger. The only option is to kill them. <laughs> I think we're going to steal their fuel as well. Uh, well, surprise, surprise, this one is taking us out. We're going to kill this person. Hopefully it doesn't break the stick because we need it. Hello and welcome to the Bristly Stranger. Yeah, uh, we're going to try and forget about that and move on with the rest of the adventure. Let's get back to the road and see where the next options are. So we're going to stick to the plan, we're going to ignore the fuel in the trader's camp and go straight for the survivor. Daytime survivor, we should be able to see what's happening. I'm not so scared about the fast ones when I can see them. It is going to use up four of our fuel, so we will be desperate for fuel after this. But I think the survivor is going to be much more useful than anything else at the moment. So let's go and see if we can rescue whoever it is. Uh, day seven, dawn, there they are. Oh, oh. There is a noisy one. There is more teleporting garbage all around the map. Oh, there's another noisy one and a fungus one. Ah, oh, this guy has got a toolkit though. That would be useful. Now this fast one looks different from the other fast ones. Do not like. Okay, Mitchell. He's got a flare gun. You come to here. Get me out of here. I would love to. Uh, we can't shoot it because we're out of actions. Okay, so I've come up with a plan. We can use Kelly to move to here and assist. That way, Mitchell can possibly shoot this one. No, he still can't. All right, what he can do... Oh, I was a clicked on him. Yes, we can shoot him. Excellent. So that'll be one less. Blam. Take it down. We've got a fire here as well. Hopefully this will take out this other fungus one. Hmm. Okay. Lily. Cannot get through this way. Go there. The long legs is going to get near you. Alright, we'll come this way then. And again with Ike. We'll come to here. Hopefully we can attract this one got lots of loot. More importantly, we we'll want to save whoever this is. They have got a toolkit. Let's see what happens. Hopefully they can move closer. Aha! Fire is on the move. Kelly. Can't get through here. Okay, in that case, Mitchell, search that. What have we got? A medical kit. That's absolute rubbish. Shield. That is much better. Uh, okay, this thing did move too. And so... We move to there. And... We move to here. Kind of want to kill this one. I don't think we can get close enough to it. Kelly, give an assist. I don't think we can get round this way though. No. Can we use the teleport? I don't think that's going to help either. Is this person trapped in here? I can't see any way to get to them. It all looks like it's blocked. Mm. I think if we use this teleport, we are going to teleport next to something we don't want to be. Be okay if it's here, 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 or here, but if it's here, Mitchell is in trouble. That's got the shield though. Let's risk it. Uh, it didn't work. <laughs> okay, after all of that. Uh, Alright, we'll just move on to the next turn. Uh, yeah, there's long legs coming. Um, 
Lily, running out of options. Let's move you to here. Ike, you move to here. Search. What can do with finding a weapon? A uh, flare gun. Yeah, we can't shoot it this turn. Kelly, there is no way round. I think the fire has scuppered us anyway. You come back the other way. Oh, is that going to be too close? Should be okay. This Gribbly's got so much choice. Okay. Yeah, Kelly, just come back. You, why are you there? Come out! Okay, yeah. This one has gone after Kelly. Um, if we come to here, can I... No, I cannot exchange. Okay, Mitchell, you come here. Give your shield to Kelly. There's nothing we can do with this. We can't pull it out of the way or anything. There are lots of Gribblies coming. Hmm. I wonder if we move to here. Oh, I don't want to use the radio. Let's undo that. That's a wasted turn. Okay. The shield. We can only shove it. We're going to have to try and kill it though. So we'll have to pick up this. Shoot this. There we go. We'll pick up the medical kit. Move back down here, Kelly. You come to here. You still can't do anything. You have got your shield though, if it attacks. Let's see. And then Mitchell. Oh, you come one more. Ugh, we're running out of time. I don't think we can save this person. Yeah, this one doesn't attack. There are tons of them. We've got a fire. Such a shame. Uh, what did we find? A pipe. That would be useful. Okay, Mitchell, you come to here. Get the shield. Can we shove this guy away? Yeah, that doesn't do anything. Just pushes him. Kelly, you get the pipe. Um, we're kind of alright down here. Yeah, everyone's okay where they are. We want to move Kelly closer though. So... Move to here. We're going to swap the shield back just in case this noisy one does decide to attack us. I'm so disappointed we can't save this person. Okay, and Lily, you stay where you are. Ike, you come to here. There we go. Oh, the fire is everywhere. Oh, too many. Lily, kill this guy. Get in. We've got fire on the floor. That is going to cause us... Big problems. Ike, you get in as well. Are we going to have enough time? Yes, Mitchell can get in on his own. Which means, Kelly, you can get to there. Somebody else is going to have to pull you in. And we all know women drivers are the best. Ah, oh, she's out of actions. Misjudged it. Okay, let's just end turn. We're safe for this turn don't think I think the the random generation has generated them trapped okay come on Lily turn on the engine get us out of here okay so the next two close locations we've got the choice between fuel or supplies I think we're going to have to go for fuel the supplies yeah if we weren't on such low fuel I think they'd be lots better. There is a vehicle coming up. It might have better things. But I don't think we're going to make it to the roadblock without that fuel. So yeah, fuel it is. We're going to have to go for that. 
let's head out. Okay, here we go, day seven. We've only got slow gribblies. There's some fuel there. There's a vehicle. Hmm, interesting. This person. Let's see if we can actually interact with them. Uh, Lily, you're going to be the face of the company. Okay, just leave me alone. Okay, you're having none of it. Um, Mitchell, you come here. And push that. that that's pulling. We didn't want to do that. <laughs> okay, push, push that. Not pull, push. There we go. Um, sure. Kelly, if you move to here, assist Lily. I'm fairly certain Lily can do nothing with this person apart from attack here. Yeah, that's absolute rubbish. Mm. Yeah, we're going to move this way. We need to look up here. Ike, you're coming in this direction. Straight to there. Search for here. Hope that it's going to be fuel. Yeah, I think we can get a few bits and pieces. Okay, and turn. Okay. Thankfully, whoever this person is, is drawing the attention of the Griblies. Okay, Lily. Really, I want to pick that bottle up with you. But if we do that, you can't get to this place. Ah, what was that? There's another one coming out of the ground. Hmm. Okay. Kelly, go and stand on top of that. Another one? What is this all about? Okay, Ike, search. Get that fuel. And pick it up. Not at the expense of the medical kit. I'd prefer to leave the boombox than anything else. Um, and just come back. We're going to fill that up straight away. Same with Mitchell. You get that. Oh, it's only one. Come to here. You can fill that up next turn. Let's see what these guys do. What is this? I don't know. But we have got guys coming out of the ground. Um, Mitchell, fill it up. Go and get your pipe back. There we go. Same with you. Fill up. Go and get your radio back. Let's actually pick it up though. There we are. And Lily. It's just going to be fuel. Well, the SUV is empty. Don't think it can carry items. We can't actually look at it. Hmm. We'll search the shed then. There we go. It's just going to be fuel and lots of it. Okay, so that's four fuel. Can we... No, we can't give it to Kelly. Kelly. Switch to you. We can push this. I think it'll be more important to have this out of the way. Hmm. Now we can give Kelly the fuel with Lily. There we go. I think I want the fire extinguisher over the shield though. Okay, Kelly. You move to here. I don't think anything's coming out of the ground just yet. Should be okay. Yep. Alright, we'll just end turn. Yeah, this person's searching. They're going to find fuel. We've got enough fuel now, assuming we can get back to the vehicle. Oh. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> They've been sucked into the ground. Uh, right. <laughs> Things are suddenly going badly. Uh, we're not going to be able to do anything with these people. I'm fairly certain the only option is to attack that one. Are we? Can we attack this? We've got nothing to attack with. Uh, 
Okay, Mitchell, move to there. Let's swap over. Yeah. Now, Ike, you've got that. Can move to there. Out of options. We're going to have to check next turn. What was that? Um... Right, I think this might be the end of the run. Yeah, we can't do anything with this. Ah, uh, right, okay. Uh, I think the option is get in with both of them. And get out of here. Okay, we can't escape because they're both injured. Oh, what a terrible turn. So they've patched themselves up. And now they've stood in front of the van. Uh, okay. Uh, we're going to run you over. Yeah. That's made the ram fall off. Um, I don't care. We're getting out of here. Oh, what a terrible go. <laughs> okay. That was possibly the worst one yet. We lost two people. The only two people we've got left are both injured. We can heal them up. I think what we're going to do, we're going to go to the car, try and heal up, try and scavenge whatever we can get our hands on. Uh, I think this might be the end of the playthrough though. I'm tempted to just go straight for the roadblock, but I think we need them both healed up to full before we go there. I tried to be clever. It all backfired. Oh yeah, let's just go and check this car out and see what we can find. Day 7 sunset. Oh no, that means we're going to have night time for the roadblock. So many guys here. I think we're just going to jump out this side with Mitchell. Got the boombox. Uh, IQ jump out here. That is there goes over. We'll have to heal next turn. Oh, you noisy one. Okay, Ike, heal. There we go, heals himself. Ike. Where are you? There you go. Heal him. Now, we could have a look round. We've got the boombox, we've got the pipe, we've got the medical kit. I think we're better just to get out of here before we get injured. We'll go straight to the roadblock. Ah. Oh. I don't know, we could get there and try and search. It's all getting a bit hairy though. Yeah. I think we're going to wait till next turn. We'll see where the Gribblies are up to, and then we might just bug out. Yeah. Okay, we've still got a space on the road to get past. Well, I think we're going to have to... No, I think actually we can just drive through. So yeah, Mitchell, get in. And Ike. We're back to the original two. Turn on the van. Get out of here. Nighttime roadblock. <laughs> we ran that guy over on the way out. Okay, I think this is going to be end of the line. I have noticed that... Up here on the miles, we got up to nearly 3,000 and then it jumped down and then it went up to 3,000 and now it's jumped down again. I don't know whether that's a bug, but yeah, obviously we've gone much further than that. But night time, roadblock, we've got no lights. I think this is going to be end of the road. Let's have a look. Okay, so I can see before the lights went out, there was at least two things in the way. We've got lots of this fungus. That does look like a bad guy right in front of us. Mitchell, yes, it's a noisy one though. So actually, we do want to kill him anyway. Mitchell, you haven't got a weapon. Ike, you have. You kill this thing. There's another one over there though. Ah. Oh. If we take a step to here... Uh, Ike, you'll have to wait till the next turn. Hmm, oh well. 
for now, we're just going to have to wait. Ah, uh, here he comes. There's another one there as well. Oh my goodness, there's about 20 of them. Yeah, this is definitely game over. There's no way we can get past all these guys. Alright, so what we're going to do... going to give Mitchell the pipe. We are going to drop the medical kit, take the bottle. We're going to kill that one with the bottle. Blam! There you go. Mitchell, you're going to step here and here. Yeah, here we go. And there's a fast one as well. We've got to move this out of the way. I don't think we've got any chance of clearing the roadblock. Maybe we should have took that SUV. We could have drove around them. Hmm. We'll have to kill this guy next next turn. We'll pick that up. I think we're going to just come this way. Yeah, there's not much we can do. Let's just go through. So many coming. Yeah, another noisy one's just come out of the ground. Ike, move to there. I think we can search that next turn. Hopefully we find a weapon. Push. That's still in the way of the road. Oh no, there's just so many. Kill this one. There's another one over there that we need to kill. We're just going to be swarmed, I think. Uh, yep. <laughs> yeah, there's another noisy one over there in the dark. Come here. Kill that one. Okay, we have got a stick on the ground. Should we just kill this? It's a two-headed one. Let's search. We might find something better. A boombox. Uh, do you know what? Let's turn that on. And then, if we pick up that one... don't think we're going to need the medical kit. I think it's too late for things like that. We'll come here. We've still got another boombox. Hopefully they're both attracted to that one. We do need to pull this out of the way. Probably to there, but we've got a three-headed gribbly to take out. No, not a chance. Dude, there's so many coming out of the ground now. This is end of days. Uh, we can't even pull this out of the way. No, we've got not a chance. So you know what, I think we should come here and we should just go out swinging. Oh, we can't even kill this one. <laughs> That's another good thing to know. Okay, we'll just move out of the way. Yeah, we're just going to end our turns. We're going to let them surround us. In they come. Oh, Mitchell, what have we done? <laughs> yeah, we can't do anything else. I think, Mitchell, go and stand next to Two Head. They're going to surround Ike. Let's just watch the end of this. I'm sorry, guys. I'm feeling guilty. There's nothing we can do about it now. They're both going down. They're completely surrounded. There's still more coming. End turn. Goodbye, guys. Sorry, Mitchell. Sorry, Ike. Lily and Kelly on the previous one. Oh, it all went wrong. Okay, so here we are on the game over screen. What a shame. We did get to the mountains. I've never even seen the mountains before. We made 27 stops. Look at all that fuel. We only used two vehicles. We had four survivors at maximum. We didn't save any of the dogs. We abandoned lots of people. We didn't have a lot of choice with them, though. I mean, looking down here, I think this white-haired lady... Yeah, Tiff, that was the one that we had to leave behind. She was stuck in the trees. There was no way we could save her. Oh, what a shame. The Miles thing, that must be a bug. We travelled much further than that. But I think this has been a brilliant go. 
I think we're probably going to try another playthrough of this. Maybe a ruthless playthrough where we just kill and maim our way through. Or maybe a passive playthrough, I don't know. We kind of did a semi-passive one then. It all started going wrong when Ike stoved somebody's head in with that fire extinguisher. But I hope you'll agree with me, this has been an awesome game. I've been the Bristly Stranger, and I really hope you'll join us for our next playthrough. But for now, thanks for watching, and goodbye.